hello guys welcome back so in this video I'm going to show you how to come up with an exception here uh, so I'm trying to connect to SQL server using Java JDBC so I have this exception here saying Microsoft SQL server JDBC SQL server exception so I have copied this whole exception in notepad and this says the connection to the host desktop name instance SQL server has failed and it says this whole thing but so you can see here it says clearly that verify that the SQL server browser ser service is running on the host so how to come up with this problem is just go to your start and search for SQL and you can see here SQL server and whatever the year it is and configuration manager just click on this so you can see these are the configurations so make sure your SQL browser service is running so just click on SQL server services and you can clearly see here it is stopped so just start it right click on this and start and now we'll see if I have an exception again so I'll just again run this file So again I had an exception but this time I have some different exception here it says the SQL server uh, sorry the server SQL Express is not configured to listen with TCP IP so so it is also done in the same place just go to the same configuration and here you can see SQL server network configurations click on this and you can see protocols for SQL Express so here you have TCP IP it is disabled so make sure this is enabled now yes just click on apply so you can even actually add a port here to listen by default if you don't add any port it will take by default 1433 but it's better to actually add a port at the place IP all 1433 apply now this is done now I'll just close this I'll try to restart my SQL server services so just search for the SQL here it is restart mm, I'll just go to my application and then I'll run this again Sorry, I'm supposed to run this connection manager, right? Sorry. So I have connection successful here, you can see. So without any problem, I'm able to connect to my desktop SQL server now. So this is it guys. This is how you can actually handle exception when you're trying to connect from your JDBC to your SQL server. Sorry, Java to SQL server, sorry. So that's it guys. Thank you for watching.